Hi, honey. Uh, I know over the years I've told you a lot of times all the ways that I love you and all the ways that I think you're an amazing person. Um, but sometimes, you know, our friends and our family don't really get a good chance to weigh in on just how much they love you and how great I think that that we are together. It's amazing that we know that we're good together, but it's really great to hear other people uh, say that they uh, they think we're good together too. So I just wanted to take this time to let a, let a few other people, uh, you know, kind of put in their two cents and uh, tell you what they have to say. Sometimes when you see a couple, you just know they belong together. When the two of you walk into a room, it's obvious you belong together. I love knowing that you are each comfortable in your own skin and you are confident in your love for each other. Yet you don't take your love or your relationship for granted. In fact, quite the opposite. It seems like you naturally take each other into consideration and are always striving to make the other person happy and to feel loved. You have a wonderful relationship and I am absolutely thrilled for both of you. So the first time Nathan said, let's go on a double date with Curtis and his girlfriend. I was honestly super nervous because I'd never met Lauren before. I had no idea what she was like. Um, but three plus years later, I can say that I am so happy to have you guys on my life. Um, going on double dates with you guys from our annual camping trips to just hanging out watching a movie has been so much fun over the years. And it's been awesome seeing you guys grow as a couple. Um, you guys are perfect for each other, truly. Um, Eric and I have loved every second of being around you guys and um, Lauren coming to Curtis and I's sporting events and all the crazy nights we've had together just as the group that we are. Um, we love you guys a lot and we know that these next forever uh, is going to be really incredible. We love you guys and uh, today's going to be a special day. I remember 23 years ago when Lauren was born and I would go into her nursery in the evening after she was asleep and pray for her. I read or heard somewhere that it's never too early to start praying for your children and their future spouses. So way back then, I would go into the nursery and pray for Lauren and for the fine young man that she would find. I believe she found you, Curtis, a young man that loves Lauren loves God, and is a follower of Jesus Christ. Curtis and Lauren. I would say where to start, but obviously I'll start with freshman year. Uh, you two are both some of the most genuine and kind-hearted people that I've ever had the privilege to meet and most likely ever will meet. Uh, and that's what makes you two both so phenomenally perfect for each other. Um, you know, you each build off each other's weaknesses and faults and create a relationship that will leave even the most hopeful, romantic, envious. And at that, I would like to say, I love you both. And... Growing up, I always wondered what it would be like to have a sister. I was always curious because people at school would say, oh, my sister and I are gonna go do this, or oh, my sister and I are gonna go do that. And ever since Lauren has come into our lives and our family, I don't have to wonder anymore. I know what that feels like. and. It's nice to know that I'll always and forever be able to know what that feels like now. Lauren and Curtis, I am so thankful to have had the opportunity to watch your guys' relationship grow throughout college, starting way back when we lived in the dorms together to now Curtis and I being in OT school together and Lauren, you and I being roommates and getting to grow our friendship. And I want you both to know that I'm here to support you both through it. I'm more than confident that you both have a wonderful life ahead of you full of new and exciting adventures. I am confident that you guys are a perfect match to be able to endure all of life's beauties and challenges that come your way. Curtis and Lauren, you guys just fit. It sounds corny, but you do. Um, I can tell that you really um, make each other happy. You really like to be with the other person and you can really be yourself um, around the other person. Um, over the past years, I've had a blast hanging out with you guys and you guys are really awesome. It's been so cool that I've been there since the beginning back in Seedman and I have watched your relationship change and grow and seen so many laughs over the years and I wish you guys nothing but the best. I know that you're going to have an amazing life together. I love you both so much. Lauren, you're one of my best friends. 
and I know that Curtis and you are going to have a great life together. Hi guys! Um, I can't believe it's been five years since you moved, both moved into Seedman with me. We became friends and then um, that one day when Curtis gave Lauren that chocolate rose and you guys um, started your relationship together, we've been through so much since then. I mean, you guys have had your ups and your downs. I can't wait to continue to experience this with you guys as you move down the road and we get to go on so many more double dates through life. When I first met Lauren, uh, one of the things I enjoyed uh, immediately was her smile. Lauren has a beautiful smile. She smiles a lot, which I enjoy. And together they are very photogenic and uh, produce some very nice photos together. But you can see in the photos that uh, when they are smiling together, uh, that they are smiling together. I also think Lauren uh, enjoys Curtis's humor. Uh, Curtis jokes around a lot and he has a good sense of humor. And uh, Lauren enjoys that and laughs with and at him, as we all do. And I believe if they can keep that sense of humor throughout their relationship, that uh, that will be a major plus um, for their happiness. I love you, Lauren, because you're a great friend to me. You laugh with me, you cry with me, you listen to me rant for hours on end, you listen to me share all my stories, and you love me so much, and you love everybody around you so much, and I think you're an amazing person, and I think you found the perfect match with Curtis, because he brings out your goofy side, you guys balance each other out, you get to share your life together, you share your faith together, you share so many things together, and I'm so excited for you guys, and I love you, and I think you guys are perfect for each other. Well, Lauren, uh, I have to say that I remember the first time that Curtis talked to me about you. Um, it was our freshman year of college, and we were both home for Christmas break. And uh, I was spending the night at Curtis's, and he told me how amazing you were, and how you totally understand him, and you're just as weird as him, and that someday you might, he might marry you. And I remember thinking, man, you've known this girl for what, a few months? Like, you never know. But um, here we are, what, four years later, and you guys are still going strong. And it's really fun to see how you guys have grown. And um, you've been really great for Danielle and I just to be able to go camping together. And we've really been able to grow closer together um, with you guys. And I just am really excited for you guys' future. Um, Curtis, I prayed for Lauren that she would find someone that thought the world of her, and you are definitely it. Um, also, I prayed that she would find a good Christian man, and I am so thankful that when you told me, oh, a year or so ago, about the two of you studying the book of Proverbs, um, that just made me ecstatically happy. Hi, Lauren and Curtis. Um, I want to first start off saying how much I love you guys, um, not on, only individually, but together as a couple. Um, when you guys first started dating and I was living with Lauren, Lauren just became this whole other person. Um, when you guys were together, she had this big smile on her face. She was so incredibly happy. Um, it was amazing to see that. Um, and when I first started dating Tyler, I wanted to mimic my relationship a lot off of what you guys had. You guys were spiritually connected, emotionally connected, physically connected. It was incredible to see. And, um, a lot of times, especially now, not many couples are fully like that and thats it's just incredible to see someone who really has the whole package um, to people who really truly love each other through thick and thin. So I know um, I am so incredibly happy for you guys that you guys are together and I love you so much Lauren and I know just like... <laughs> Through this whole entire process and us being best friends, you've always been the one person that I can rely on. And I don't know what my life would be like without you in it. And seeing Curtis in it as well and how much he has added to that impact, it has been absolutely fantastic to see that. And I just want to let you know I'm so excited to see what the future holds for you guys. And um, I just love you guys so much. <laughs> I'm going to start crying. <laughs> Um, but I wish you guys all the best and everything. So now that you've heard why all of our close family and friends think our relationship is so amazing and why you are so amazing, 
I think it's my turn to be able to tell you how amazing our relationship is and how amazing I think that you are. I'm so excited for the roller coaster of life that we get to go through together now and in the future. And I cannot wait to spend that time with you. I love you so much. And not just because of the person that you are, but what you mean to me and how you've affected me. You are a rock for my life. You have been since before grad school, you are during grad school, and I know you will continue to be throughout the rest of our lives because that's who you are and that's what you are to me. And I love that. And that will never change about you. You are the most compassionate and loving person that I have ever met and I'm confident that I will ever meet.